Deborah James, 40, was diagnosed with stage 4 bowel cancer in December 2016, and has documented her health journey heavily. The BBC podcast presenter took to Instagram to share a video of herself dancing to Celine Dion as she is told she can be discharged from the hospital soon. Deborah posted the video to her Instagram in view of her 325,000 followers. She can be seen sitting on a chair before taking off her robe and unveiling a gold dress. Deborah then mimes and dances to the song to celebrate the good news. She captioned the video, For over two weeks I said to the nurses, if they talk seriously about discharging me out of here I'm doing a Celine Dion. So I got my mom to drop off a glitter dress just in case. Well today I finally had positive chats about sending me home once I'm done with a few more days of four. It's all coming back to me. Yes it took my whole day of energy to get dressed and do this, but my word it made me smile and that's such a good thing. Hopefully it will make you smile too. She continued, I've got a long way to go, I'm not counting my chickens yet, and certainly not over the finish line yet, but progress is progress, finally. Many social media users took to the comments to wish Deborah well and share her good news. I am Lauren Ma and said, UFG icon. Giving me full stars in their eyes. Sarah.Scott17 added, Legendary. Can't decide if it's the socks or the pad test safety sticker on the hairdryer that really makes it special. Dr. Sket Cancer to commented, Legend, end of. So good to see you in sparkles and up. Really hoping you can get home soon xxxxx. Ali. McEwen complimented Deborah, as she said, I am utterly moved by your endless and infectious joy. You make more of a difference to people's lives than you will ever know. Thank you. XX. This post comes after the BBC podcaster told her followers how she nearly died in hospital last week. She penned there had been a lot of tears for days, saying, Today has been one of those days where I feel like we are going round in circles. It's the small things that break you sometimes when you are in hospital for too long. It's the failed cannulars, being unable to move freely, not feeling like you are making progress, the daily worry about each test, the daily analytics of every bodily function. The former deputy head teacher turned cancer campaigner has been living with stage 4 bowel cancer since she was diagnosed in December 2016, and was told early on that she might not live beyond 5 years. Deborah has been in and out of the hospital for months, having undergone another procedure just before Christmas to remove a bile duct stent. It was the same month the Fuck You Cancer author celebrated her five-year milestone since her diagnosis. The surgery was performed after doctors learned Deborah had developed an aggressive tumor next to her liver over the summer. She has frequently said as a vegetarian runner, she was the last person doctors expected to get the disease, 